So today we are uh, celebrating that we have more than 1,600 students that are receiving recognition for their seal of biliteracy, um, which means that they have accomplished being proficient in English as well as another language. Students, they get a golden seal on their diploma. They also get an annotation on their transcript as well as uh, there are possibilities for their um, college and universities admissions that give them extra points for being um, the students that receive the state seal of biliteracy. Uh, and then some employers also see that as an added component and an asset for them to be hired. Being bilingual when they're looking to go to college, get jobs, interviews, just be a productive member of society. It's just something else to help with being able to work with community, global market. I'm proficient in Russian and Ukrainian. If I, if I see like people needing help or something, and I can speak the language, I'll help them. And if they need like a translation, I'll do it. To share ideas and, um, you know, connect. Wonderful. We'll have a higher advantage of getting into like positions because we can help those who don't speak English, you know, so we have like both of the languages. You bring more to the table yeah. in a way because you have the advantage of speaking two languages and you have like an open door for both cultures. The world is getting smaller, right? And so having a skill that uh, with biliteracy, being able to read, write, listen, understand and speak in more than one language is uh, definitely an asset. And so it, it actually makes them more profitable and um, they can compete more for what they are um, wanting to achieve. They put in a lot of work and they, they earn, you know, I would say they, it's well deserved the kind of the recognition that they get.